Hello and welcome back to the Righteous Reichlanders. Last time we got some of the remaining holdings that we needed to get in our duchy over here. And well, now we just need to figure out what we're doing next. I think that we're going to go and... Oh, we got a, new, a couple of new claims we can press actually. But um, I think what I want to do is I want to press for the other part of this one. For uh, the other part of P. Faildorf, I think it's meant to be... Uh, uh, that's how it's meant to be pronounced. Anyway, uh, it's got 11,000 troops. He does have some vassals that you can call upon. As in, I'm saying that he does have, like, these ones, which I think are mercenary companies like we have. So he has some of those, but not a lot. So we could potentially go over there and take a lot of stuff. He's excommunicated still. Oh, what awful. I mean, does he, why didn't he just pay the church like we did? Anyway. Um... I think we're going to take the remaining bit of land here. Because he only controls one bit of land, so we're not going to use the one that gets us all the bits of land in the duchy. Yeah. We'll take that, and then he will no longer desire that land. Well, he might, because it might still be within the de jure borders of... Yeah, it's still within those de jure borders. But he won't have the duchy for it, which will be a positive. Yeah. Let's uh, declare a war. I want to take that land. We're obviously going to say, yep, let's do it. Raise up all of our troops. Uh, these ones are a little bit far away. And directly in enemy territory. Uh, those 21,000 can all meet up here. In Drunberg, which has enough supply limit for it. And then I'm also going to raise all these mercenary companies. Because there's no reason not to. Because they're so cheap for the amount of men that they provide actually insane how cheap they are yeah it, it, it's just insane they're, they're too good but you know whatever we'll have them anyway yeah that seems good another 19,000 uh, and then everybody will meet up in this province and then we'll get rid of the ones that appeared over there right Three, two, one, and unpause. Let everyone move towards their position. It's fine. They have a lot of troops. They do actually have a lot of troops. We have double theirs. Um, my Grand Prince, the more I study the Sigmarite religion, the more I feel compelled to embrace it and to show you the wisdom that lies in its texts. Whatever. I've sent you excerpts from the most interesting parts. I urge you follow my example and embrace the Sigmarite religion. Sure. Yep. No real problems there. Uh, don't know why that event popped up. It might be because we were a different religion and then we uh, religion switched. So that might be why that's there. I'm going to disband those guys. They're too far away. They're going to take forever to get over here. Right. And I'm just going to walk over this way. But yeah. Um, yeah, It's probably because we religion switched. So we probably had him as court priest while we were a different religion. He then, uh, that didn't trigger the thing that allowed him to have that event. And then when we switched religion, it didn't turn that off, maybe? Yeah, that, that kind of makes sense, in a way. Yeah, I could see it. Because a lot of the events in this mod are, like, a lot of these um, actions, like the switch religion one, are not quite the same as the vanilla ones, from what I can tell. Like, they're all a little bit... They're just a little bit twisted. So they're all... A, like, um, what, where was I looking at? There was, there was an obvious one that we saw last episode. Uh, I've completely forgotten where it was. Oh, yes. Actually, we saw it this episode as well. When we were playing the Dejure claim, there's a new Dejure one. It looks like the old one, but it does something different. Like, it's, it's very similar, but, you know, it's very slightly different. Which is a lot of these ones. That's fine. Um... Anyway, it, didn't it doesn't cause us any problems, that bug, so that's fine. 36 versus 20 should be an easy win, right? We have good leaders? Yeah, let's go for it. Oh, they actually have... Uh, oh, they have an elf leader. That's interesting. Um, oh, children lack an education. Oh, no, he's got a cough. Hopefully it's nothing. Um, learning is his best one. I don't really want to give him a learning education. That sounds like that would be awful. In fact, all of these are awful. 
Willful. Actually, what's the what's the negative of timid? Craven. Hmm. Humble's the best, but shy and craven are bad. Then willful's bad one is brave and stubborn. Well, uh, stubborn is the bad one there. So a neutral willful is more likely to be good than a neutral timid. That's going to be... Hmm. Also is affectionate, which is all... All of those are fairly okay. Then stewardship would push up his stewardship, which would be good because it would allow us to hold more holdings. But actually we can get the same benefit from diplomatic. I don't know. I think I'm going to go for diplomacy on the logic that affectionate is good. So we're going to probably get kind of that. We're going to get an extra diplomacy. So we're, we're talking, we're at six diplomacy already. Uh, al already? Already? What am I talking about? Already? Anyway, so that will put us up to like seven, eight diplomacy plus whatever, whatever bonuses we get from that. Willful. I don't know. It might be brave. It might turn into brave. That might be all right. It's probably not going to be ambitious. Yeah, let's give them diplomacy. Let's hope it turns into something good. Who had, what's our education? Oh, it's just awful. Okay. Uh, I want to get him an educator who's good. Um, now we could go for this, uh, for, well, for this person. Yeah, we got gray eminence. Generally all right stats. That seems fine as an educator. The only problem is she's not a follower of Sigmar. And somebody... Like, I do think that the person who said that we should switch to a... Reichlander Sigmar kind of character was right. We go with Hansi. He seems okay. Wait, no, he's a brilliant strategist. He's not okay. He just does amazing... He has amazing diplomacy, but he's uh, not got a diplomatic education. I think that does still matter. There's a Grail follower. Hmm. He has no Marshal. But he is... Oh, he's also the wrong religion. Well, I... Given that we don't have anybody amazing who's the right religion. Uh, actually, what I could do is look in the find characters thing. See who we got. So I want them to be my religion. Uh, I want them to be not my culture. Which is fine, because that's pretty much everyone. I want them to be an adult. Um, that's about it. Oh, they have to be in Diplo range, obviously. Uh, don't care if they're a ruler, really. Yeah. Oh, they can't be in prison, because then they can't do it. Okay. We're looking for high diplomacy. So, she's got the wrong one. All of these people have the wrong one, actually. Oh, Rudiger. He has the right one, but those stats are rubbish. Anybody else have the right one? Henrik has the right one, but stats are rubbish. Apart from diplomacy, a lot of these people's stats are just, like, straight up bad. Hmm. A witch hunter sounds like an awful plan. Also, witch hunter is a culture? Interesting. Uh... Neil, or... Nel... Nelly? She seems alright. Yeah. Absolutely fine. Her her traits could not be more green. Um, yeah. Sure. Let's uh, assign a guardian. Oh, yeah. My child. Uh, with that one. Yes, that seems fine. Yeah. That's fine. That works out okay. Yep, we should still win this through our numbers, even though they have uh, good leaders. Good, the guardianship contract went through. We barely lost anyone in that, actually. That's fantastic. Um, we'll, we'll wait and assault this down. Do I want to spend a thousand gold for 50 cultural tech points? Yeah, sure, why not? What do we get in the next level of legalism? Absolutely nothing. Tolerance? Probably worth putting one in there. So we don't get as much of an opinion negative from having the wrong culture right now. Okay. Salt that down. Oh, wait. Ooh, I just, uh... Oh, I, all I did there was take away an assault they previously had. I didn't actually, uh... Get us anything. Okay. That's fine. Right. 
Um, we have 4,000 defenders. That's pretty good. I think our assault should still be alright, though, with 30,000. We have another daughter called Enza. Um, why don't you have a duty education? Seems good to me. Another 15 days. Uh, my court physician is worried about my newborn daughter. Well, obviously, try and save her. Built a major trade uh, route city. That's going to be a lot more money coming in there. Nice. How much are we making now? We're only making 83. Oh, that's because we're spending a lot on our retinue. And we probably are losing money from our being over the domain limit. Yeah, that's all right. Assault it down. We lost a few men, but that's okay. Uh, his treatment was a failure for my daughter. Oh, well, my daughter is likely to die. Oh, well. Not a big deal. All right, continue assaulting it down because it's the war goal. Yeah, there we go. 100%. Offer peace and force demands. This is now my land. Does this one have a trade... <laughs> as a trade post as well? Oh, it's so tempting to just hold on to it. And I think I might. Uh, well, we did get a lower... We got a lower holding as well, which we can give away. We're going to be well over our domain. Yeah. How much of a penalty are we taking for that? 60% penalty. That's rough. But, at the same time, the trade posts do not take the negative from that. So we get all the money from the trade posts. So, you know, still alright. Oh, I've, I've got some malaise. Oh, that's not good. Uh, how many years do we still need to wait till we can get rid of elective? Another six years. Well, I can't be ill now. Uh, he thinks that we're developing the Okra Pox. Well, hopefully that's not true. Thinks our illness was caused by too much laughter. He forbade everyone to tell his jokes and that actually worked. Oh, well. Fine. Oh, no. We have diarrhea. Uh, don't really want to die, if that's okay. Yeah. Just sorting things out for my son here. I think I want to invite her to court. No, she really likes the Headmaster Torbjorn and has no reason to move. I mean, I'll send you a gift, but I don't think that's going to be enough. Now, it's almost enough, but not quite. I was just seeing if I could invite her to court so she could continue being an educator. Because I don't think you mean educated in a foreign court when you're the ruler. I could be wrong. I'm never 100% sure about that. Because so, I just never seem to remember it. Uh, we've, we have the Okra Pox. Um, okay, that's negative 3 health. That's pretty bad, I'd say. How bad of an illness is it? Oh, that's a severe illness. So that's negative 4. Huh. Well, that's not good. I don't need help managing my titles, thank you very much. Um, I do, however, need to be uh, healed. My life is in your hands, definitely. Yeah, 100%, we need to be healed. Wait. Uh, I trust in your knowledge, a wise one? This one's a different one. Oh, you can perform a mystical treatment. You know what? Use your mystical magic. Is he blind? He's a blind mystic. And we're just going to trust him performing some ritual. Mirror Lovell instructed you to step into the empty tub and left you to undress in private. Lovell's return was herald heralded by a loud bah. He was followed by a servant and half a dozen goats. With a deft hand, Lovell proceeded to grab the goats and slit their throats over the tub one by one. The stains on the floor will not go away. I feel different. We've been mystically altered, which lowers our health, and we have become cruel. Oh, that didn't work at all. Now we're on negative five health. We're, we're dead any second now. Um, oh, we have a prisoner we can ransom. Nice. And then I'll release the... Uh... Well, you know what? No, I'm just going to execute the elf. Right. I'll get the money for Frank. Is that age 192? It was. Wow. He'd been around a long time. He was, uh, yeah, barely uh, mad, and he, he was maimed as well, so, yeah, okay, he was lucky to still be alive, so, you know, we kind of put him out of his misery. That's the way I'm going to justify it, anyway. 
Adon is trying to fabricate a claim on the march of Ubersrecht. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, well, I hope we stay alive. We're not actually at negative five health. I just remembered we do have the family focus, which is plus one. And Tough Soldier gives us another 0 0.5. But the problem is we have to wait till Mystically Altered goes away, which is in another year's time before we can actually uh, t get another, uh, like, chance at healing ourselves. It's not a great spot to be in. But if we can hold on for another six years, then we're good. I don't know if we can. I didn't mean to do that. That's fine. Uh, yeah, whatever. That person likes us more. Yeah, okay. Duke Emilio has ascended to heaven at age 33. He died of the Aquapox. A shining example of diligence, his duty was never neglected. A godly man, Emilio is with Lord Sigmar now. Merely 12 years old, the realm was left in the capable hands of the Regent and Council. Long live Duke Lionello. Oh dear, is our educator the same? No, our educator is now our mother. Who is a great eminence? Let's, let, that is okay. Okay. Um, diplomacy is all right. Now I'm just seeing where we're at. Uh, vassals, they don't hate me that much. In fact, most of them have a po Oh, never mind. He absolutely despises me in every way, shape, and form. Okay. I think I want to switch religion. So let's convert. It loses us piety, so we're... Uh, no, it loses us prestige, so we're going to be negative prestige, but gains us piety. Okay. That's fine. Obviously, for my successor, I'm going to nominate Severio. Yeah, that, that makes the most sense, my brother. He is amazing stat-wise. Oh, and the Duchy of Wizenland, I'm obviously going to nominate myself. Even though we have no chance. Marshall is going to be... Well, we have a Doan as a powerful vassal. Let's put him in as our Marshal. He really doesn't like me. He really doesn't like me. Yeah. Oh, well. Crown Focus is going to be our capital, assuming we... Well, we're a little bit prospering, but we could be more prospering. Okay. We need a court priest. No powerful vassals can be court priests, so... I'm going to put in Franco instead of putting in Blast. Even though Blast is better, I think having one more person like us a little bit more who has some land seems like a good idea. It's going to be a very delicate situation in terms of survival here. Who really, really does not like me right now? Adone doesn't like me. Okay. Well, we're going to have to try and improve his opinion of us, really. Prove diplomatic relations there. Okay. We will send gifts to anyone we can send a gift to. Well, that's 2,000. That's a little bit much. And it won't improve his opinion of us that much. 32, that's into the positives. Powerful vassal. Yeah, okay. That's fine. We got a couple who like us okay now. I don't need help managing my titles. My mother is my educator, so that's fine. Yeah, we should be okay. Oh, sorry, my, my mother is my regent, which should be fine because that will mean that she's not going to give away our titles, hopefully. Yeah. Uh, I do want to build everywhere as well while we're at it, although I don't have as much money as I would like for building everywhere. Uh, these ones, let's get one of those ones. Uh, yes, nothing we can build in any of the forts. That's fine. Trade offices, definitely. Trade offices, we'll grab some more. The nice thing is, our retinue is probably strong enough that we can take on anybody with just the retinue. Which is a good situation to be in. Or like, we can take on any of our vassals with just the retinue. So unlikely that factions are going to rise up against us. Okay. Well, it's fine. We just need to be in charge for uh, 10 years. You'd like this person to be my educator. My liege does not like me that much. Um, 
I mean, he's got the... No, I want my mother to be my educator. I'm sorry, Leash. That's just not the way I'm gonna go for things here. He doesn't like me very much. Refuse the offer of guardianship. Now, the problem is we have spines, so there is a chance he just kills us. We also have this cough, which is um, a little worrying. I could offer to join my Leash's war against an independence war or against Peasant's Revolt. I'm not really worried about either of them. What is this independence war, anyway? Just this guy? Wait, he only holds one bit of land. He only has a thousand troops. Why is this even a war? I mean, he does have the High Prince Galad backing him, but that's only, that only puts him up to 5,000. Yeah, okay. Well, we're fine, then. My courtier, Elgamar, uh, has started uh, studying the uh, Myrmidian faith. All right. Interesting. That is interesting. Don't know why Adon's hidden himself away. Uh, I guess that... Oh, wait. No, he's secluded himself. It doesn't say he's hidden himself away. I know it is with this court. So is he hiding from the... He must be hiding from the illness, but it's not going to come up here. Okay, Adon has fought for somebody to join all the factions, but they're still not going to be stronger than us. He's wanting seniority succession. Um, yeah, I don't really care. That one's fine. Not a big deal to me. Seniority is actually fairly alright for us. We don't have that many people in our... But if we did switch to seniority, that would be absolutely fine. Because, um, there's only, like, what, four people... Oh, never mind. Uh, I need to go to this one. Yeah, there's only... Yeah, there's only... F yeah, there still is only four people. In our um, like, in our house, who can actually inherit seniority would mean that they would be the next four in line. That's that's absolutely fine. That's the same as switching to primogenitor, basically, for us right now. Apart from the fact that it would bypass Severio, and would instead go to a, a, a Toden first. That's fine. Wait, how did this guy get land? Oh, a Toden's dead. He died a natural death. Oh. All right then. Well, that's not good. Yeah, so now more people are being forced to join factions, but no factions even slightly to the, like close to our power. Need a new marshal. We have a powerful vassal. No, we have no power. Oh wait, we have one powerful vassal, but he's not going to be a good marshal. In which case, they all absolutely hate me. It's not great. Um, I'm gonna put in. I'm not going to put in any of my commanders. I could put in Hansi. Let's put in Hansi. It's alright. We're going to have people disliking us for a long time. Yeah, you might as well stay where you are improving relations. Wait, why do people... Wait, does my spy master hate me now? Why does she hate me? You used to be okay with me. I mean, we do have a negative... Um... Yeah, we do have a negative 100 with her. I might need to give away some of my uh, domain provinces. What do I still have? I still have a lower one here. Let's give away the Barony of Mepin. Yeah. That seems unnecessary at this point. It's going to make all vassals like me slightly more. By 10, in fact, for every single vassal. This is okay. I'm still a little bit over. I have... Hmm, do I have any other land? I could give away this one. I mean, as you know, that one has a trade post. That one has a trade post. Um, wait, does everything I hold have a trade post now? Oh, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. No, one of these doesn't hold the trade, doesn't have a trade post that I hold. Olenfer, my old capital. Hmm. Do I give it a. I think I might give my old capital away. Yeah. In theory, there's no reason to hold it anymore. It's just not as good as the other provinces I hold. Yeah, let's give it away. Um, okay. Do I have anyone on my council who's unlanded? I have this court priest. I could potentially... Well, he's not unlanded, but I could potentially give him Molen for it, which everybody would say yes to. Yeah. That seems sensible. Where, where does he hold land? Currently over here. I'm not too worried about that. Yeah, let's give this. Well, actually, is Molen Fort in a Dutch? It's probably in a duchy I hold, right? Yeah, it's in a duchy I hold. Uh, I'm gonna give that away to the court priest. 
just on the logic that that's probably gonna that's gonna make one more person on our council actually like us yeah so he now likes us that's fine um that, that's good yeah that's just a good position to be in okay um what are our expenses right now Best new upkeep and liege. Yeah, that's fair enough. I do know that we were pushing some stuff in here for... We did have a campaign fund. Ah, no, it looks like they're just pushing it one over. So somebody else is trying to vote people in. I'm not that worried about the campaign fund then. We won't, we won't reinvest. Technological advancement. Um, here... Castle infrastructure gets us more castle tax, which is quite nice. I did see that we're no longer next in line, which is unfortunate. Trade practices next level, though. More trade value? Gotta keep pushing into there, right? Okay, um, does that get us anything in Altdorf immediately for trade? Probably not. No, nah, we already have everything in Altdorf. But it will just mean that we're making more money. Who's next in line? Somebody got two votes? Hmm, he did. Interesting. Oh well. Not a lot we can do there. We just gotta hold on. You realize you've been free from your cough a few day, uh, for a few days now? Being able to sleep at night without waking up coughing is a blessing. Nice. Um, hopefully nobody's going to kill us. That is basically our main uh, hope here. Although we are a prime target for being killed. This person needs to like us. I already sent her a gift. I, need oh, I only have one honorary title and she can't have it. I could give her my amulet of protection. But I think an amulet of protection sounds fantastic for me right now. Um, what land? What's, what's her duchy? This one. Um, does she hold both its land with... No, she holds no land within it? Wait, what land does she hold, then? Oh, wow. That's a weird bit of land. Oh, so this person is not... No, that person is her vassal. Oh, that's a very weird duchy to hold. I could put uh, this guy underneath her, which would increase opinion. I think I will. Having her have a positive opinion of me is good. Oh, that did get rid of our steward, which actually means I could put in this guy as a steward. Which would be alright. He hates me, but now you hate me slightly less, which is okay. Please, uh, please collect some taxes. Uh, I could send him a gift. It's still not going to improve his opinion of me that much. Not The problem is not a lot of these are, in, like, some of these are opinion of predecessor, but that's not really the main reason they dislike me. They dislike me because I'm holding too much. Hopefully, once I come of age, um, I'll have enough, uh, like, I'll have enough diplomacy that they'll all like me. I don't know, I might have to give away more land, which is something I hate as a concept, but... Maybe I could give away some of the land that isn't within my capital duchy. I mean, I still make some money that way. Like, I would still make some money by, um, like, they gain money, therefore I gain a percentage of their money. But, we'll see. We'll see. I do like how the disease passed us by, which is very nice. Oh, alright. Uh, I just spotted the time on the episode, so I think it is actually a good time to end. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.